Meghan, Duchess of Sussex and Prince Harry are currently on day seven of their royal tour of Southern Africa with their son Archie Harrison Mountbatten Windsor. Royal watchers have been delighted with the Duke and Duchess of Sussex's decision to allow a glimpse of the royal baby, as he met Archbishop Desmond Tutu this week. However, other aspects of the new royal's life have been kept private, notably with Archie's christening and godparents being kept from the public. Although the privacy decisions were surprising, in taking these steps Harry is trying to emulate his royal cousins, who he desperately wants to be like, according to a commentator. Podcast Royals, from Australian magazine New Idea, heard from royal expert Angela Mollard in an episode that first aired in July. Podcast host Zoe Burrell said, We know that Harry is desperate to give Archie an upbringing just like his cousin Mia Tindo. She asked, do you think that's possible? Ems Mollard replied, I know he wants to, I know that's what he desperately wants for his children. However, she added, I don't think it's possible. Ems Mollard continued, I've been reading, biographer, Angela Levine, she spent a lot of time with him, I think nearly a year on royal tours and in interviews. She knows that what he really wants is this private life for his child. He very much feels that he's down that hierarchy from William, it should afford him the kind of life that Zara and Peter Phillips enjoyed. He's looked at his cousins all these years and thought how smart it was that Princess Anne didn't give her children titles. They've been allowed to grow up fairly normally, both Zara and Peter, and then their children, Mia and her little sister Lena, and Peter's children, are just not in the limelight. I think that's what he desperately wants for Archie. Can he have that? I absolutely don't think he can. She went on, they, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex, have become the face of the brand. I don't know how you prosecute your purpose, which they want to, in terms of environmentalism and working for the Commonwealth, alongside privacy. Archie is going to have attention. The royal commentator added, I think they should respect the public interest in them. It's very very hard to ask for request the privacy, when you are shooting off in different directions. I think it's entirely possible to gain some degree of privacy, but I think they need to think very cleverly and clearly about how they execute Archie's public role going forward. He will be of interest, and how you manage that and take that into your own hands I think is is going to be pivotal. They need to get their wishes but the public needs to have their interest in the family fulfilled. She also gave her opinion that the Duke and Duchess of Sussex should take advice from Kate Middleton and Prince William in how to handle bringing up children in the spotlight. Ems Mollard said, Archie is going to have attention, in the same way that the Cambridge children have attention. Purely because his parents are young and glamorous and we are interested in them. She continued, I think, Harry and Meghan, should take some advice from Kate and William, they've done it really well. Yes. Their children are visible but they own that message. 